it's a ball, you can, you should, ah, you should get it again. Morning, you guys. Welcome to Way Beyond Pad Thai channel. Right now, we're in Cusco, Peru. This morning we are going to go experience some local food, local drink, and the local market. Let's see what do they have to offer here in San Pedro. The San Pedro market or Mercado de San Pedro. We also gonna go try some coca leaf, which is like the the leaf they used to do the cocaine thing, but. It, it's just all natural here and it's so common here. As pretty as it's supposed to be. Juice, 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 juice. Look at this. This is so random. They have this thing. Where is it? I saw it. Pineapple eggplant. Got it. We got a pineapple ginger juice for four dollars. No. Wholesale is in 50 cents. Nice, the ginger give it like cuts to the sweetness. Here in the market, you can find this big bag of the coca leaf for two solids. That's like less than a dollar. And it's gonna give you energy all day. Though, yesterday we tried the coca tea in the restaurant, but then right after we got into bed, we just Gone. But we had dry coca tea. This is wet coca tea. Dry. Oh, so this is dry and wet. Oh, this is the wet one. And you need the activator to chew it. So in a, most people use baking soda. In Thailand, they have the, the lychee nut. Uh huh. So it needs the activator, mm -hmm. the lime. This needs something like it to make it activate in your mouth. Oh. Ecuador, Ecuador, Melek. Natural. Yes. Este es ceniza de los de las Ay, como mazorca de maíz, de la quinoa. Normalmente este es sin sabor. Por eso algunos le ponen menta, le ponen anchoas. Two for this, and then this one has no flavor in it. Usually they have like mint and stuff, but this one is mint. Oh, mint. Yes, one, no? Sí. Very small, amigo. Ten leaves with very small de activator. Alright, Kevin, let me see. Try to peel off the stems first, but some cocoa leaf. Mm -hmm. Tastes like tea. <laughs> what? <laughs> it doesn't, nothing's different. It just tastes like you're chewing on tea. <laughs> what about it? Yeah? You feel anything at all? No. Probably gonna be like a cup of coffee, probably. Uh, they have like a super big corn nut too. Uh, like with chili, with spicy. See. More chili? It's grande, no? Grande. This is other one. Uh, Coca candy everywhere too. This is a like, small one for three solids and then a big one for ten solids. This place is pretty organized. They have the cheese aisle, then they have the bread aisle. To come get the local food, this is probably the spot to be. On the left side of me. On the right side of me. Super local. They have all the sandwiches, coffee, chocolate, tea, and what I really want to go for is that soup with the pig feet in it. Looks so good. Mmm. It's like. But I'm not so sure. Kevin doesn't like it too much. Oh, gracias. That is crazy. Blending in with the local. We're sitting right here in the local spot. And it's a lamb soup. Or Cordo de Cordero. Smells super salty. Mm. I love soup. Oh, super lamby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh. It's 
smells like it tastes. That's a lot of meat. Look at this. Yeah. That's like, that'd be like 10, 10 bucks in the US. Yeah. Oh, I think there might be some stomach. Or, oh, no. Yeah. Give my money. Let me try this before we put some lime in. See this? What is it? It's parsley. Wow, you can literally taste the meat. <laughs> it tastes like American lamb, I'll tell you that. You said it's like mountain lamb. It's good, I like it. It's like super meaty, right? I am going to try the meat itself. Okay. It's tender. It's a hard work he got. Try not spill. <laughs> um. My first piece. Okay, we need to eat these potatoes. Get some room in here. It's so hard to eat. Wow. Look at that, you guys. Oh, empty. One, two, three. Um. This is nice. I got a piece of meat to try it. It's like the first pico de gallo. Alright, this one with the chili sauce. Both with and without are good. I like it with. We got like the whole potato over here. They love the potato. Two of them actually. The whole thing. Mm. It's this potato. Ooh, see that deep? It almost feels like they deep. Oh yeah, it's a little bit different, I guess. Yeah. It's different. You have to see it. It's a little bit firmer in there. And have the texture that almost feel like it's um taro, but it's potato. It's not that smooth. There's some of the texture that make it spatial, and I like it a lot. Mm. Oh my god, that was a huge meal. Both of us sharing one big bowl. It was so good also. This is what I call it real local. There's still a lot more of the the stores that I wanna check out maybe later because today I'm quite full. Maybe we're gonna go for like one more snack or sweet or something like that. Other than that, I'm really not sure. <laughs> I'm quite full. Oh, this is a bong. You can... You should, ah, you should get it again. Watch out, if I buy that, you might use it. Ah! I thought Thailand was already like harsh on that stuff, but damn, Peru. <laughs> They're aggressive. I'm at the juice shop, but this is a little bit different than the one inside there. Real fresh, and then this is. Thank you. Pero un Pure it right here. Cut it right here. And then do it all right here. Have a cup of this. Almost like this. Two solids. Let's try. It's all orange juice. No water, no nothing. Mm. Refreshing. Oh, yeah. Super good. Damn. That was such a nice scrolling at That was such a nice scrolling around the market seeing something we've never seen, eating something we've never eaten. Some of them we've seen before and some of them we, we've eaten before, but still we're in Peru and everything kinda exciting. Especially for like the lamb thing that we have for five dollars or less actually less than five dollars. 
huge piece. We share two of us. The coca leaf, I'm not so sure if I want to chew that, like, I'm not sure. Numbing my mouth a little bit. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, so I'm not too sure. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog, and I'll see you guys in the next one.